things. Let us magnify his name. Manashante Rabufa Satari. Elegi dun durono she talibre gedu kadanse eto she kadibe. Gunsen tere bashun tere basoko toro bo she karede. No son to no mo vasakante she kadiba. Mara dance the feluse kataje. Father, we just say thank you, thank you, thank you. Mandele bruno so for contos de lembre. Imazeka toshe kade la pregudu se fatase. Father, we say thank you. For in Jesus' name we have prayed. You're welcome to the 21 days fasting and prayer. You're welcome. You're welcome. It's great to see each and every one of us here again today. Happy New Year. Um, we are indeed gathered here to give thanks today. We are going to be in a mood of thanksgiving all through today. And I pray that we open up our hearts and just lavish our praise and adoration upon the Lord our God as we go on with the praises today. Psalm 95 says that, Oh, come, let us sing to the Lord. Let us shout joyfully to the rock of our salvation. Let us come before his presence with thanksgiving. Let us shout joyfully to him with psalms. For the Lord is the great God and great King above all gods. In his hand are the deep places of the earth. The heights of the hills are his also. The sea is his yeah. and he made it and his hands form the dry land. Can we just come off mute and just praise him? He said he is the great king above all gods, all gods, above everything that you think you have exalted. This scripture says that he is the king above all gods. He said in his hands yeah. are the deep places of the earth. The heights of the hills are also his. Wherever you think, how far you think you have gone, God, God surpasses every single thing we think or we know. So this scripture says, let us come before his presence with thanksgiving. Let us shout joyfully to him with psalms. Can we come off mute and just give him thanks? Thank him for being a great God. Thank him for being our father, yeah. our king, our husband. Zephi Thank him for every single thing. Maradam Brano Sefa Kotal de Lepe Kalambra Leveledos. Oh, the Brigadu Santana Velebrantelli Kanda Valente Sakonda Veta. The Masheka Tota Kanda Lavarantele Broso Kombe Velebra. Moko Baba Fafa Talebe, Moko Mase Karebe, don't believe it. More by Reberon Kobaran Katare Bosa, Levendo Lobro Conta Lababa, Moko Bashamara Sakatan, Mosa Terape Shakatela, Mase Katoshe Kandi, Moko Baba de Katakantole, Father of the Christian, come before your presence, I got to Shikan, Mase Katan Baraka, Labezo Tondo. Father, we just say thank you. Santa Rabashi, Ranta Kabaseti, Mosika Tisha Parababa, Omonoshe Kandi, Nikorabashe Kandi, Roto Sokotomba, Imagine Tarababa, Roto Dot of Ostoka, Father, we say thank you. We just say thank you. Mandege Obrano Sepranasti, Mande Kadusa Katan Bebele, Orobondo Robondo Rodosti, Moko Bele Belebelo Sutarabashi, Radasha Darabashi Branasta, Rakadasha. Father, we say thank you. We say thank you. Thank you. For in Jesus' name we have prayed. Amen. 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 
Amen. Amen. And still in the mood of thanksgiving, Psalm 69, verse 30 says that I will praise the name of God with a song. I will magnify him with thanksgiving. We know what it means to yeah. magnify something, to enlarge something, to make it seen, to make it known. And some of us that are here, you know that when you're giving um, compliments, you know how you feel, how happy you are, how, how, how elated you are in that period. I want us to just come yeah. to this um, altar with thanksgiving and magnify our God, magnify him according to how he, how, how, in short, how he has, what he has done for you. And even to the future, what you know that he will do, because everything that we desire, everything that we want has actually already been done for us. So can we just magnify our God with thanksgiving? With this, our thanksgiving, yeah, let yeah. us exalt our God. Let us magnify yeah. him. Let us, it's like yeah, carrying him yeah. up and raising him up for the whole world to see. Yeah. Can we just come up mute and magnify him? him mavanda rabaso kotoshe barebe mosa kanta shaparebe he says i will praise the name of the lord with a song with a song amana nana setere rotosa kotelebe shika dele berondo roboshe kali la bredoshe king of kings and lord of lords the lord god almighty masheka tosha leka lima sota maker of the heavens and the earth oh jabo elito and la bavuje de rebo segere Father, we magnify your name. We praise you, O God. You are the great King of Kings. You are the great Lord of Lords. Mandole Belika, do Baranda Sabra de Gadusa, Brada Stakide, Lobronos, the Brigadita, Branas to Godo, Imbregaligre de Gabasha, Branas to Oro, Yakerebis. Jesus, we say thank you. Jesus, we say thank you. Jesus, we say thank you. If it had not been for the Lord, that was on our side. But time and time again, you never left us. Lord, we praise your name. Lord, we exalt your name. Manos de Catoshi, Moko Babashika, Rantanza Kande, Ulobrono Basiti, Onde la Bregoba Nazante, O Bishante Rababa. You are the God of Baliba Sunta Rababa, Rocco Tonje, in the heavens and the earth. Mashe Catoshi Karababa, Rotolopo de Capamba. You say a thing, O God, and it comes to pass, O God. Who can say a thing and it comes to pass? If our Lord in heaven has not said it, can we magnify our King of Kings? Can we magnify our Lord of Lords? The Lord God Almighty, with the lips of God, with the fruit of the lips, magnify Him, magnify Him, offer Him thanksgiving, offer Him praise. Amen. First Corinthians 15, 57 says, but thanks be to God who gives us the victory through 
our Lord Jesus Christ. I want us to know that throughout yeah. all this while, and even till now, 2022, 2023, the Lord has been with us. And a lot of us have had our testimonies of victory, of how the Lord came through for us, how the Lord came through for us at every point of need. Even some battles we did not even know about, the Lord was fighting for us. Mm -hmm. And the scripture says that we should thank God for who has given us victory through our Lord Jesus Christ. That means that in the office of the Christ, there is our victory is already secure. It's just left for you to yeah. enter into that which God has done for you. And then you claim your victory. You claim your victory. So I want us to just thank God because God has been merciful to us. God has loved us unconditionally. Even when it was yeah. like we're not even worth it, he continued to favor us. He continued to give us victory. Yeah. He continued yeah. to keep us. He did not allow the enemy to do whatever he felt he could do with us. So can we thank him for those victories, for the thanksgiving, for the oh, testimonies, master, for every us. single thing? Let us just thank, thank you, him. Thank Thank you, Father. Because you have given us 
In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Guys, you're welcome to the prayer call. Um, before I could or continues, we have some instructions from God. The first three days of these prayers are dedicated to us Thanksgiving. Mm. Just thanking God, not asking for a simple thing, for a single thing rather, but just thanking God from the depths of our hearts. So as we take these prayer points, just reflect on God's goodness, his faithfulness over the years, and then throw yourself into thanksgiving. Over to you, Akudo. Okay. Go ahead. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Psalms 103, 1 to 4 says, Praise the Lord, O my soul, and yeah. all my inmost being. Praise his holy name. Praise the Lord, my soul, and forget not all his benefits, who forgives your sins and heals all your diseases, who redeems your life from the pit and from and crowns you with love and compassion. Can we just thank God for his mercies upon our life? Indeed, it is because he is merciful. That is why we are here today and that we can also give him thanks. He said that he will show mercy upon who he will show mercy to. And indeed, he has shown us mercy. He said he desires yeah. mercy. He said that we should praise the Lord and we should forget not all his benefits. Sometimes the way we have lived our lives does not even warrant that maybe God should even look at us because he is a holy God. There are a lot of things that people do that he cannot even look at sin, but it is because of his mercies. It is because of his mercies that he can still draw you close and show you his love. So can we thank him for that, for, for his mercy? He said he forgives us our sins and heals us of our diseases. He redeems our life from the pits, not only redeeming us, then he now crowns us with love and compassion. Can we just thank him for the mercy, for his mercies upon our life? For every single day, the scripture says that morning by morning, new mercies we see. He has programmed that so that once we wake up, we are showered with mercy. Can we just thank him for his love, for his thoughtfulness upon each and every one of us? Let's come off mute and just thank him. Thank him. Thank Thank you, Father. We 
Amen. Amen. The scripture in Hebrews 12, 28 to 29 says that since we are receiving a kingdom that cannot be shaken, let us be thankful yeah. and so worship God acceptably with reverence and and awe. For our God is a consuming fire. It says that we are receiving a kingdom that cannot be shaken, that cannot be shaken. And that is what we hinge our confidence on because we have a God that cannot be shaken, a God that regardless of what happens, we know that the least in the kingdom of God is even greater than the highest in the kingdom of the enemy. So we know where yeah. we are coming from. We know the strengths that we gather from. We know there's this saying that if um, somebody like a president comes to meet you and tells you maybe they want to give you, let me just say something like a private jet or so, you will believe because you know that that person has the capacity. But maybe if somebody that maybe you just work with every day that you know that doesn't have that amount of money in the account comes and gives you a promise like that, you probably will not believe. But because we know the God we serve, we know that he has the whole world world in his hands. We know that he's the creator of the heaven and earth. So his kingdom cannot be shaken. Nothing, nothing in the kingdom of darkness is, is up to what our God has, can, cannot even reach that capacity. So we want to thank him because it is because of that we have our confidence in him because we know that his kingdom cannot be shaken. We know that he stands strong. We know that he stands strong from beginning to the end. Our God is strong. Our God is greater. Our God is mightier. Our God is beautiful. Our God is excellent. There is nothing that the enemy can even stand. There's no way the enemy can stand beside him. So can we just come up with and just thank him for that kingdom that cannot be shaken, for that kingdom, that kingdom that we, we, we know, that we believe in, that we trust in, that we know that we are hinged on. Can we just come up with and just thank him? Father, we thank you. Father, we thank you. we thank you, we thank you for the kingdom, for the confidence we have in you and cast in our wonderful will for us that we answer so terrible, so terrible we go back to Kataraba la biso kubabasa rantele basuka Father we just say thank you, we continue to praise your name, we thank you oh God, rande geno dole kuya, muka dale belu kunose, muka dasa hande, la produce the hande we have received the kingdom, the kingdom cannot be shaken. We have received the kingdom that cannot be shaken. Master Kota, Mr. Kande, the confidence we ask, we will ask in accordance of your word for us that you would answer. Thank you, Father. 
Amen. Amen. For in Jesus' name we have prayed. Amen. I want us to just, still in the mood of thanksgiving, just thank our God for this holiday period, for the peace, the peace that the Lord furnished each and every one of us with throughout this um, holiday period. We didn't get any reports of um, accidents or terminal illness or anything whatsoever. So I want us to just come off mute because he said that his peace that he has promised us and indeed he gave us peace. I particularly have a testimony and even within the period where everything happened, there was still this peace that was in my heart that confirmed that God was with us in my family throughout that period and indeed he showed up for us. He showed up for us. So I don't want you to think that maybe um, the peace that God gives is, is something you can trivialize. No, it's not something you should trivialize. God gives that peace and he knows the essence of that peace. It's an economy that he furnishes you with so that you will still have confidence in him amongst all, every other thing. So can we just thank him for the season, the protection, yeah. the, the healing, yeah. everything that happened throughout this season, everything, yeah. the graces he bestowed, the peace. Let's just thank yeah. him. <speaking in Spanish> Thank you for protection. Thank you for your love. Namasoko Father, we just say thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Amen. Amen. I want us to still in the mood of thanksgiving. Thank God for his provision throughout this season. For provision, he has provided for each and every one of us, provided for us, whether financially, whether spiritually. A lot of people were able to rest and even recoup at least a lot of people were able to get their prayer altar at this um points continuously burning we do not trivialize such things um in the tribe it's not just to have maybe financial blessings or so there's a whole lot that goes on before you could even um, talk about the physical financial capacity that you have the spirituality the balance of your faith and everything but we just want to yeah. thank god because god has really provided for us in this season and even with that to come into this fast to have the peace and also the grace to also come into this fast we just want to just thank God for everything because he's the one that gives capacity. He's the one that gives capacity for us to bear, for us to bear every single thing that we go through in our lives, whether spiritually or physically. 
So can we just come up with it and just thank God? How he provided for us, how he kept us through. Yeah. Scripture says that godliness with contentment is great gain. A lot of things yeah. were very okay. We didn't have so much maybe, but we were content. We had our family. We were happy. We were comfortable with our spiritual life. We had a lot of things that people trivialize that believers, we understand that the little things matter. And that is what we are thanking God for. It may seem little, but it is the thing that forms the family foundation of the life of the believer. Can we just come up with and just thank God? Thank him for provision. Thank Father, we say thank you. As a tribe, we say thank you. As a tribe, we say thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Father. Father, we say thank you. Jesus, we say thank you. Mashe Katobi, the provision for provision, the protection of God. Mashe Katoshi. Thank you, Father. 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 In Jesus' name we have prayed. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 Very quickly, very quickly. I want you to know the importance of what we are doing. Thanksgiving is underrated in most places. We spend five minutes thanking God, and um, we don't know the importance of it. Um, we've explained several times. You see, your heart takes the shape of an incense. The Bible says, out of the abundance of your heart, your mouth speaks. As a man thinketh in his heart, so is he. When you begin to speak toward God and pray to your Father in heaven, an incense will arise from your heart. You must know the importance and the power of what we are doing. That incense is your signature in the spirit. It is yours and yours alone. Nobody can fake it. If it does not come from you, then there is no incense for you in heaven. It has to come from your heart. And the, the, the beauty about it is that when we all then gather like this and everybody releasing incense, then a corporate incense is created that begins to rise up towards heaven, very potent, very strong. The Bible says that the prayers of the saints are collected in golden vials. I don't have time to explain how Prayer walks in heaven. It's something that God revealed to me. But you should understand that if things did not work out for you last year, or you began to count your losses or regret something last year, 
and you feel like maybe your business is stagnant or declining, something is not growing, the secret is thanksgiving. If you don't thank God, oh, my friend, if you don't thank God, you can't stop the hemorrhage, the bleeding. We will find time to teach about it. It's not, it's not, it's not on this call. But I want you to know the importance of what we are doing so that you can fully participate and throw yourself into it. Because through Thanksgiving, we change a lot of things in the spirit. Through Thanksgiving, we get God's attention. That's how we get his attention. And it has to come from every tongue. Because the Bible says in the book of Philippians that every tongue shall confess that Jesus Christ is Lord to the glory of the Father. So when you begin to thank God, your heart is saying Jesus Christ is Lord. And then God is taking glory. He's, he's being glorified because you are, you are raising a, a shout. You're, listen, perhaps you are Ghanaian, Kenyan on this call. You represent a particular tongue. And until every tongue on earth confesses that Jesus Christ is Lord. Until that happens. Until that happens, the Father is not fully glorified. So you have a part to play. A very important part to play. So it, it's in one corner, it helps you in whatever you are going through in your life. In the other corner, God is glorified. I went through something recently and, and I was asking God, what is the secret to come out of this thing? He said, Thanksgiving, just do Thanksgiving. So I switched it up to Thanksgiving. And that became how I overcame. So as we continue in the prayers, know the importance of Thanksgiving. Know the importance. All right, Akudo, please take it away. Over to you. Yeah, okay. So the scripture in Isaiah says, Isaiah 12 says that, and on that day you will say, give thanks to the Lord, call on his name, make known his deeds among his people, make them remember that his name is exalted. Praise the Lord in song, in a song, for yeah. he has done glorious things. Let this be known throughout the earth. I don't know how... You want to minister to the Lord in a so with a song today, but I trust the Holy Spirit to give us um, harmony while we all sing. Can we just come off mute and express our thanksgiving to God in a song? If he has led you to sing in the um, language of tongues, please go ahead, but just express yourself in a song that you know yeah. that when you sing that song, it is just you and your God. It is just you and your God. Just forget the remaining people that are on this call and just imagine your father in heaven, Jesus on the throne, you and the Holy Spirit in that deep, intimate relationship. Can we just come off mute and sing that song that song that he has given you, you yeah. and you alone. Na Sante Rani na na Santana. Zaco na na ni na Sante Rani. Na si na ma si ta. Shata pantele talante. Zela dantele kembra. Zatu kere prada dante. Ma <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. 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 
Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you,
The scripture in Psalms 107 verse 8 to 9 says that let them give thanks to the Lord for his unfailing love and his wonderful yeah. deeds for mankind for he satisfies the thirsty and fills the hungry with good things and I I don't know about anyone on this call but I'm a product of someone who the Lord has satisfied satisfied my thirst and also filled my hunger with good things from the years that have come I know that there are different times when I had this hunger for the things of God. And at every point, the Lord would probably just lead me, I would say, to a message or something that would just at that point to look, it's like the answer to the prayers. And not only that, the manifestation of his blessings in my life physically. That's why the scripture says that he satisfies the thirsty and fills the hungry with good things. I wanted to understand that there is no hunger or thirst that you will have as long as it's according to the will of God that the Lord himself will not satisfy. That is the truth. He said that his love is unfailing and his deeds are wonderful. So can we just thank him for those periods where it was like you were confused, you didn't have an understanding of some things, but then the Lord now sent somebody either through a message or either through um, somebody that just spoke a word to you or either through a song that ministered to you at that point. You received help and then you were satisfied and then you were satisfied. That test, that hunger, that patch, parchment, that patch dry taste that time that it seemed like you were in a wilderness that you did not have that understanding but then the lord sent satisfaction he watered you at that point and then you were filled with the good things and not only that you saw the manifestation of those things in the physical those things you prayed for those things you longed for the lord satisfied you and this scripture says that he satisfies that means he will keep satisfying you it's not a one-off thing it's not a one of things. As long as you long after the Lord, scripture says that if you desire, if you, if you desire after the things of God, that he will satisfy, let your desires be according to his will. So can we just come off mute and just thank him? Thank him for his unfailing love, for his wonderful deeds, for the times he satisfied you. Yeah. And even to the future, the things in the future where you know that you will desire when you want to expand, where it's like your building capacity. And maybe at that point, you don't have an understanding. And the Lord just sends a message, sends a helper, sends somebody, said that he's the Ebenezer, that his your help has come. He sends somebody to satisfy you at that that point, then you know that the Lord is really there for you, that his love really is unfailing. So can we just come off mute and just thank him for the times in the past and then look to the future and just thank him because prayer is just the only thing you can really send to the future. Nothing else. Can we just come off mute and thank him? Psalm 107 verse 8 to 9. Father, we thank you for your unfailing love, for your wonderful wonder. Thank you, oh God, for the time you sat by the test most of the rate basso e che cosa mi cabasta carame o se cattolica mi cobabasta cando ci vedi lo sentire bose cande pro tutto con lo bose cade father we just say thank you thank you na dite me pro tosa cande rate bebe mi cobabasta ma sho corbo mi costa cande e che dolce manama mi cobabasta carame Thank you, Father, Thank you, Father, 
Amen. I see in the spirit already. The spirit of God says to tell someone, a warring angel has been dispatched over your case. Amen. And I'm seeing this angel, I see him very clearly in the spirit. Just by thanking God, a warring angel has been dispatched. Just by thanking God. I don't know who you are. I'm seeing a couple of things, financial problems, legal problems. And the spirit of God is to tell you that a warring angel has been dispatched. I'm seeing somebody else. There is a wound that has refused to heal. It's a witchcraft attack. It's a wound that has refused to heal. A warring angel has been dispatched. A warring angel has been dispatched. I'm seeing another person. Oh my God. I see the amount of anxiety that was waged on your heart in the last three weeks. A lot of anxiety. A lot. A lot of anxiety. Depression. And this thing has forced you to pick up some vices that you shouldn't be doing. Yeah, and the Spirit of God says a warring angel has been dispatched. Oh my goodness, just by thanking God, look at the wonders of thanksgiving. A warring angel, a warring angel. There's somebody else, you've come to the end of yourself. You can no longer fight. It's as if you're exasperated. Yes, I see you in the spirit. It's like you're tired of running. Yeah, yeah. And, and the spirit of God says, uh, an angel that will carry you from here has been released. Has been released to aid you, to help you in your journey. My goodness. I see why God asked us just to thank him. Can we thank God for what he's begun to do already? Can we just thank him? Let's thank him for what he has begun to do. People's problems are being solved without us asking him a single thing. Just thank God. Thank God. Thank God. Mazate Felica Prasa. Thank you, Jesus. 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 Amen. 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 Guys, I'm just, I'm just announcing breaking news. That's all. I'm seeing in the spirit now supernatural depth cancellation. The spirit of God says before the end of this month, you will experience what we are saying. It's supernatural depth cancellation. You went into depth over something and you don't know how to come out. He says that the anointing present now will break that yoke. There will be a supernatural cancellation of depth. That's what God is saying. Can we please 
Just begin to thank him for what he's doing. Let's begin to thank God. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Jesus. Guys, Thanksgiving is powerful. I'm seeing again now. God is listening. Oh, my God. God is just answering prayers right now. I'm seeing in the spirit now, there's a person, something afflicted those in your household. You're on this call in the month of December. Everybody in your household fell ill or something like that. And God says he has released a worrying angel to stand guard in front of your door. Oh, my goodness. I see this very clearly. Stand guard. And that, that plague is canceled. I'm seeing somebody else, you are on this call, you are connected to somebody with cancer. I'm seeing cancer, it's like cancer of the bones. And the Spirit of God says on account of your faithfulness and of your thanksgiving on this call, he has answered the prayers over that person, that cancer will begin to dry up. Can we begin to raise up our voice and thank God? Uh, God is his name, Thank no. Thank Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Father. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, God. Thank you, Father. Thank you. Mokozi kelebose tena ada da sata la lele mo basi pele bo shatale ni pando koto le bregedusi mashete basa kande ne 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 mokozi kelebose mase kate la di fukoba me sante le bo se kerebe ni pasi kato ne me suta la se tere bo se tere be o she kelebose kerebe. I'm getting it. Please, please, look at us as quickly as possible. We're going to release it so that we can thank God for it. When we thank God for it, then the word we can appropriate that word. We can own it and walk into the reality of that word. Now I'm seeing grain. Grain is like a sack of grain in the spirit. It's like grain. I'm seeing grain. There's someone on this call, you've been in a season of scarcity and grain signifies abundance. And the spirit of God says from today, your season of abundance will start. You will no longer endure that scarcity, that, that tightness that you experienced last year. Abundance is your portion. And as we declare this word over you, and as you thank God, you would capture that testimony as yours in the name of Jesus. Can we thank God for that? Mazan Telika Prophet, thank you. Jesus, we thank you. I thank you. Oh God, we thank you for your word that has gone to us for to God. This word will not come back to you without accomplishing that which you have has sent it to, oh God. 
Nazite lembe le bosto kotozi. Repredo se kate te kalibra. Nise to le bose de le bosto tola. Alepe do se te le be pe kade. Le skuta namba se kade. God we say thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you God. Nazite le bose te le bose antaraba. Le sente le be se kate te. Nise to lo ma se kade be. Lo so ko ba se kade be. Nikade sha kande. Mo se te le be so ko ba. Ma se kade be be se ka. Me ko se kade te. Me ko sa kade. Le ben se to lo mo se pe lo mo se. Me ko se kade te. Yan pe lo mo se pe lo be. Me ko sa kare ba ba. Rependu se kade. Me ko se kade le be be. Thank you. Amen. Amen. Now, now I see in this, I see in this, there's somebody on this call. The Lord says to tell you the prayers you prayed for a very long time. You've entered a season where those prayers are going to be answered. You prayed these prayers for a long time, over a year. I don't even know who you are and what kind of prayer it is. I see an angel handing over a note, and it says it's an answer. And he says that this prayer you've been praying for a long time will be answered in this season. You've stepped into a season where the prayers you prayed for a long time will be answered. If you will thank God for that word, you listen, every word being released, you owe God a thanksgiving when it is, it is completed in your life. Please, I'm serious. This is how we spoil things for ourselves as Christians. If, if any of these words that are being released, as we are seeing and releasing them, if it is your word and it becomes true for you, you owe God, come back on this altar and testify to God. Yeah. That's what God is saying. You pray these prayers for a very long time. And this is the season where they will be answered. Let's just take this final point and just thank God for this person, wherever he is. So that they can receive that word. Lord, we thank you. We give you the glory. We give you the praise. Father, we thank you. We thank you. We thank you. We thank you, God. We thank you, God. We thank you. Oh, Jehovah, we thank you. We Thank you for your word, oh God. Masha Tara Basanta, Nasa Tara Basta Catore, Bede, the Cedevis, Sutan, Deribe, Rotodos, Don Torobo, Sikandi. We just say thank you, thank you, thank you, oh God. Thank you, Savior. Thank you, King of Kings, oh God. For in Jesus' name. Amen. Over to you, Lord. Amen. Amen. Can we just thank God for his word that has come to us to us in this season? Indeed, the Lord has remembered us in this season. It's the beginning of season in as much as it's the beginning of the year, but it's new, it's a new season for for each and every one of us. So can we just come off mute and just thank him? Let's just exalt his name and just thank, thank you, him for Father. his word. Father, we thank, thank you. Father. We thank you. We thank, thank you for Father. your word. Thank you, God. Thank you, Father. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Thank you, Savior. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Thank you, Father. 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 In Jesus' name, we have prayed. Amen. 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 And lastly, I just want us to just thank God for the grace to participate in this fasting and prayer program for the next um, 21, 20, 21 days. Um, yeah. It's the grace of God that will actually keep you. It's not by your strength. It's not by your power. Because there are a lot of things that the Lord may be telling you particularly to drop in this season so that you can ascend or he can reveal to you that which he wants. There are a lot of scriptures he may want you to go in depth to, but you may have work or some things that when you stand, you say, yes, you need to do those things. And you don't know that this thing that the Lord is leading you to 
is what will turn your life 360. It just takes the grace of God for you to remain in a fast. The enemy would want to do everything possible, whether affliction or to do anything to pull you out of that which you want to build, the momentum. But we want to thank God because the Lord has supplied grace. The Lord has supplied grace for the fast. There are a lot of things that the Lord will tell you to consecrate. We could even call it 21 days consecration. He will tell you to consecrate this season. And it's important because those are ways that the power you build up, you build up may seep out may seep out, but the Lord is calling you to stop this at this point. He to this, do not do this, do not do this. I think it's Apostle Paul that said in Corinthians that he dies daily. So if you have to die daily for, for, for the Lord to be made manifest in your life in this 21 days, and not only this 21 days, going forward, you need to heed heed to the Holy Spirit in this season. That thing that you used to do before, but when you start doing it now, you just lose your peace. Just know that the Holy Spirit is telling you to drop it in this season. You need to die daily. Every morning you wake up, tell the Holy Spirit, I surrender. I surrender again and again and again. He has supplied grace. It's just for you to yield. So can we just thank him for this grace so that we'll be consistent, so that we'll get to that point, so that we'll see the manifestation of the glory of God in our lives. Can we just thank him? Father, we thank you. We thank you. We thank you. Father, we say thank you. We say thank you. We say thank you, oh God. We say thank you. Thank you for the grace to pass. Thank you for the grace to remain in what the Lord is doing for us in this season. Thank you, Father. We do not come up by our strength. We do not come by our power. But we depend on you, Holy Spirit. We depend on you, Holy Spirit, oh God, to lead us, oh God, in this season, oh God. We depend on you, Holy God, that as we come here day after day, day after day, oh God, you continue to show us your goodness, oh God. And you establish our faith and strengthen us, O God. Father, that we will not be led astray. We will not be distracted. We will not be pulled away from your presence, O God. Father, we say thank you, God. Thank you, Savior. For in Jesus' name we have prayed. Amen. Amen. And so, Father in heaven, we thank you for today. We thank you for your word. We thank you for everything. We ask that you accept our thanksgiving, oh God. We just thank you for you are worthy to be praised. You are a good father. You are a good, good father. Father, we exalt your name and we magnify your name, oh God. We ask that every word that has been spoken on this altar, oh God, that it will meet those specifically that it was spoken to and it will not come back to you without accomplishing that which it was sent to. Father, we thank you once again for 2023 and we thank you for this 2024. We thank you for the open heavens, over the members of the tribe, over the nations of the tribe. We thank you, oh God, because we know that this is a season of restoration for each and every one of us, oh God. We thank you for your word that has gone thus forth. We thank you for the leadership. We thank you for the members. We thank you for the souls that will be saved through the tribe, oh God. We thank you for the souls that will be recalibrated also to the tribe, the families that will be saved, oh God, the families that will come to you. We thank you for the businesses that will be restored. We thank you for the ministries that will be open, oh God. Father, we give you all the praise, oh God. We are grateful, oh God, because we know you are a good God, because we know you are a loving Father. We say thank you once again as we gather here continuously day in, day out, oh God, throughout this whole 21 days, oh God. We know that your presence will not depart from us, oh God. We just say thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord, for in Jesus' name we have prayed. Amen. 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 Please join God us tomorrow. Guys. Okay. Yeah, tomorrow we, we may move the venue from teams. We'll, we'll make an announcement before tomorrow. Please stay tuned. Same time Thank tomorrow. Thank you so much. Yeah. God bless you guys. Bye-bye. God you bless so you. Thank you, sir. Good night.